What's going on everybody? Old School Rough Repository here. Uh, small unboxing video today. Uh, picked this up off of eBay. Uh, originally the guy had the had a buy it now price, but then he also had make an offer on it. And I made him an offer on it just to see if I could get it for cheaper. Why not? And then I got to thinking about it and I'm like, you know what? Um, it's actually not a bad deal for what it is. So I didn't want to miss out on it because I lost out on a... Um, distribution block earlier in the week and I didn't want to miss out again so this is packed pretty darn good um, looks like it's been kind of custom packed here and there so little pieces of styrofoam so we get this out this piece on top so here's the first part this is our box for our splitter for running multiple amplifiers this is amp one output, mono, or stereo. This has switches on the side, so you can run it, I believe, stereo or mono, which is, I'm a little confused about it. I don't have the manual for it. But this side is all mono over here. So I'm not sure why this gives you a stereo slash mono, and this is only mono. But anyway, so here we have our inputs and outputs. Input one, input two. So there's one of these. I'll put this down here. Take the bubble wrap out. Oop, here's that little piece. This is the base knob without the uh, hair or something on it. This is the base knob without the uh, case. And hopefully it works. It looks kind of like they may have trimmed. Yeah, it looks like it's good. Being able to see it here up close on the camera makes it easier to see. Uh, it looks like they trimmed it a little bit off to the sides. But this one, he said one of them is real loose. The other one's still tight. I don't know if this one's going to be the loose one or the tight one or not. But, so there's this. Here's this piece. I'll put that down here. This is going to be... second one this is the whole knob assembly okay so this is the one that was used so here's the knob assembly this one has the two here put that off to the side and lastly should be our box which will be our last box so there's two of these I'm gonna double check everything here move this into camera range here and just to verify there's nothing else in it but the bottom of that pack job or bottom of the box is just as good as the top so very good packing um low notes audio something like that i think is the the ebay seller's name that i got this from so basically what we have here is we have two of these adapters and these will allow you to hook up multiple amplifiers um and use basically just one bass knob but that one base knob has to be this specific base knob. This base knob that comes with these units has the two outputs or inputs or whatever you want to call them. Um, I don't have the cables for these, which isn't that big of a deal because there's a guy that sells just the cables on eBay. So I don't use these kind of amplifiers. I don't own, actually I own two, I think, of the amplifiers that'll work with these. But... Um, yeah, so I'm kind of curious. I've always wanted to see inside one of these. So looks like this just kind of snaps off. I'm going to do this off camera here. So this is the inside of one of these boards. So you can see all these pins that are in here. Got a model number or a number on the, bit, the board here. PC-3217C. So interesting little configuration here. that side so we'll go ahead and pop this back on now that it's broken thank you guys I'm joking so we'll put this back together just like this and who said it was broken 
No, that part. <laughs> anyway, um, I tried to make it a quick video. Unfortunately, I failed at that, so we're already up to seven minutes. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything, feel free to give me a holler. Um, actually, having one of these in my hands now and being able to show you guys, because um, a lot of the, the, the pictures that you see on like eBay and stuff like that, they just aren't that good. They just don't tell you what everything does. So uh, I'm going to guess that you can use, and this is just an assumption, that you can use a regular base knob and run it into one of these two and run possibly a couple amplifiers off of it. I'm not 100% sure if you have to have both cables hooked up at the same time because it says input one, input two. So I'm not totally sure on that, but you know what? I'm going to think I'm going to find out if I can find somebody that's ever used one of these. So anyway, if you guys have any questions, feel free to give me a holler down below. Be sure to like and subscribe and have a good one, guys.